Hello and welcome to a new video. So if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Please give it a thumbs up. Today we have some unboxings. We have some steel books. Um, we have a Zavi one. I want to talk about that. Uh, the winners, the packages will be sending, will be getting shipped on Monday. I'll be uploading a update on that. Once you receive it, I will really, really appreciate it. if you guys can either message me, send me a picture or a little unboxing video, and then I could compile it and upload a video with that. So that would be really cool. So let's get to it. First thing, I want to talk about Zavi. So I received this one today. The postman actually just threw it through the door. Um, is this how you guys are getting your Zavi? Let me cover my address here. Your address, I mean your <laughs> your steel books on a, on a thing like this? I don't know, let me know, let me know. So let's open this real quickly. Let me cut this. All right. So this is how I received my Zavi Steelbook. Let's check for any imperfections. So this is the last Jedi, huh? Go figure. Uh, spine slash. And it's a deep one. Like every video that I make, I have some sort of damage. There it is. It's you could you could actually see it right there. Watch. You see that? Bam. You can even hear it. Oh, yeah. All right, Zavi. You, you guys keep dropping the ball. Like, seriously, this is the last the last stuff I'm buying. I, I pre-order this. I'm a completionist. So I'm just going to get them, trade them, whatever, and then be done with Zavi. Absolutely. Nice steel book. I'm not going to lie. But it's just disappointing. All right, so let's put that aside. I'm going to do a, a massive unboxing one of these days whenever I get them. Maybe next year. All right, so the next one is Tomorrowland. Am I? Is this not focusing? There you go. I mean, I think it's this that's causing issues. So we got Tomorrowland. I bought this for dirt cheap. I think it was like three bucks at a Target. So... And I didn't own it. I, I'm super surprised that I didn't own this movie. Uh, I guess I'm I'm happy I kind of waited because it was dirt cheap. It's not the greatest movie, but I'm trying to get a lot of the Disney movies. This does have digital code. So. That was underwhelming. All right, Tomorrowland. We got the DVD, which is cool. Cool to have. And a Blu-ray, which is region free, which is which is good. Uh, look at that. It's like all oh, it's three bucks, man. What, what can I, I can't expect it to be top quality, right? This I do expect it to be top quality. I bought the next three movies. I bought them at Best Buy. I was gonna buy more, but man, they're getting expensive. So these guys are getting really pricey. So. This is Mortal Kombat Legends Scorpion's Revenge Steelbook. I don't know if it's a Best Buy exclusive or not. It doesn't say it is, but that's where I bought it. So, let's open it. Oh, that's a nice color. I thought it was gonna be like a matte finish because with the plastic you can't tell. But no, it's like super metallic, glossy, beautiful. Nice, I, I, I really dig these animation movies from either warner brothers or just you know dc comics so this is pretty cool we got we got these i'm in the future i'm going to do a project with these so i've been holding on to them i think you guys will really like uh, what i'm going to do with those so here it is steelbook uh we got the spine we have two dings not too bad no spine slash sorry we have the back. Let's open this like so. Let's get a full 
full view on it. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool. I really like it. Um, Scorpion looks really cool here. Oh, is there a ding there? There's a little bit of a ding there. Um, metallic. The colors are nice, like coppery. I like it. Appreciate it. So we have some artwork. I'm sorry, but I do not know what this scene is. Okay, so what do we have here? We have the Blu-ray and a DVD. Awesome. And then we have like a throne room. I, I re I'm not, I don't know. So forgive me. I'm not really into it. So I have to watch it. And I don't know who that is. That looks like Shredder to me. Obviously it's not Shredder. Funny if it is. Um, but yeah, let me know who he is. Uh, I'll be watching it. I'll be catching up onto this. I can't know everything, guys. You know it. There's going to be things that I don't know, and I'm going to learn. And you guys are going to let me know in the comments. But yeah, awesome steel book. I really like it. Next one, really cool Halloween movie. Uh, this is the, I think this is one of the, this is the latest one. There's a lot of Halloween movies. Pretty awesome movies. Uh, scared the crap out of me when I was a youngling. Ooh, this is going to be scary. So this was also bought at Best Buy. It does say it's an exclusive. Oh, just listen to that. You can even hear the birds in the background. If you listen carefully. There's nothing like ribbon plastic of a brand new steelbook. Oh, cool, cool, cool. All right, so does this have a protective film too? I think so. We'll find out. Just enjoy it for now. The colors look really like fall, which is awesome. That's when Halloween is taking place. So very fitting that those colors are present. So let's see how this steelbook looks. I'm really digging these steelbooks with the protector. I, I mean, it's going <laughs> to ruin like Steelbook Central and uh, who's the other one that makes the, the steelbook protectors. A lot of them don't have it, but man, this is going to be taking a hit on their market cap. So watch out now. So here's the this cover. That now, I, by looking at it, I don't think it does have the protective film on this. Bam. Look at that. Is that not cool? That is a really cool looking steel box. So now let's see. We'll have inside artwork. So what do we have? We have the 4K, which is awesome. Really want to watch that on 4K. And there it is. So is this the new one or the old one? Ah, oh, now I'm confused. I don't know what I bought. Because now they, they don't even put like the when it was made, when, when was, which one is this one? Is this the old one? Let's try and find out. I just bought, I don't even have it on 4K, so I'm not worried. Uh, I'm thinking this is from 2020. This, oh, look at this. They put a disc made in Mexico sticker on my doggone cover right there. And funny enough, this disc will be more expensive in Mexico, even though it was made here, sent to the States, and then came back, and it'll just be more expensive. All right, so I don't know which one we use this one, but regardless, I'm just going to pop it in, watch it, enjoy it. I know I'll have a blast. And I don't know why my autofocus is not working. There it is. Autofocus was off. Last and but not least, Stephen King's cat's eye i'm a big fan of stephen king um i've read a lot of his books i'm not gonna say i read all of them i still need to catch up i but i read a bunch of them so 
So please let me know what is your favorite Stephen King novel. And that's another, you know, whole video just talking about Stephen King probably. So Cat's Eye, I actually don't remember much about this movie. It's been a long time. When did this come out? Oh, um, that's a good, that's a good, good, good question. I'm thinking 80s, 90s. It doesn't even say probably. Drew Barrymore. Is that Drew Barrymore? Oh my God. So this is like, this is probably like 30 years. Wow. That's awesome. All right, let me know what year this movie is. But look at that. Oh, that's pretty cute. She looks, this is like not too far or not too long after E.T. Because she's still little there. And she's been in the movie business for a long time. That's awesome. Hey, that one's not completely dry. So Stephen King's, this looks just like, you know, a graphic novel cover. They just grabbed it and just plop, put it on there. It looks like original too. Uh, matte finish, as you can tell. Pretty cool. There it is. It's so dark, it's like blending with my, with my computer mat here. This probably only has one disc, yeah. Insert artwork right there. Bam, 1985, famous films productions. So yeah, uh, I think E.T. was like 82. So that's right around the same time frame. But look at that, that's really cool. So how many still books did I get today? So I got a cat's eye, Cat's Eye, Halloween, uh, Mortal Kombat, Scorpion's Revenge. We got ourselves Zavi in there, the mix. And then we got ourselves Tomorrowland. All right, awesome. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please let me know what's your what favorite graphic novel. Graphic novel, not graphic novel, but novel from Stephen King. And what was your favorite steelbook from this batch? And man, that's so disappointing. Zavi, Zavi, Zavi still sucks. All right, guys, catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.